One term that has two, um, let's say, variables, y of t and the past values of y of t, and the second one which looks at the y of t, the past values of y of t, and the past values of x of t. Okay, so it goes from t minus 1 to t minus l, and t minus 1 to t minus l. But it's what? It's a bunch of entropies. So can we put them as circles? That's what we are planning to do here today. Let's do that. So I will have the entropy of yt given its past, and the entropy of yt given its past, and the past of another variable, which is the past of x. Can I put them in terms of the Venn diagrams and simplify things for you to show you how to calculate transfer entropy? Let's have a look. Bring me the three circles that we had a look at earlier. Let's call the first one the orange. So you remember we had h of x, h of y, h of z. Forget about that. Let's call this h of y. Let's call the green h of y of t minus 1 up until t minus l, which is the past values the entropy of the past values or version of y, and the entropy of the past values of x. Let's bring them here. I have three circles. So we looked at the relationship between these and we were able to draw, okay? Now, for the first term, I don't have three variables. I only have two. So what I'm going to do, let's remove the blue, and let's say that I have the entropy of y of t and the entropy of the past values of y of t. Now, the remaining entropy after knowing the past values of y, so the remaining of the orange circle after knowing the past values, the green, as you can expect, it will be what? This portion, the one I mark for you in blue. Now, because of that, this is like, basically, this represents the blue um, region over here, represent the first term, which is the remaining uncertainty about h of y after knowing its past values. Get rid of the remaining. It's a lovely moon shape. Now, that's the first term. Bring me the three circles again. Now I have y of t, the past values of y of t, and the past values of x of t. Name them and tell me, draw them yourself before I show you, tell me where is the remaining of the orange circle after knowing the green and the blue. Should go something like this and this and that. So if you want to plot it, I can say something like here, here and here. Sorry for my drawing, it's really bad. Take them and get rid of the whole drawing, if possible. Put a blue region over there. That's the remaining uncertainty about y of t after knowing its own past and the past of another variable, x. Okay, so here are the two terms that I've shown you here in the equation. Go ahead and tell me where is the transfer entropy? Well, the transfer entropy is simply what? the subtraction or the difference between the two. The first term minus the second term. As you can see from here, what do you think, or where do you think that portion will come through? So do you see the difference between the two? Can you tell me what is the difference between the two? Well, obviously it's just this portion. And that's your t of x to y. 